This short video is looking at saving your settings on the Yamaha E373. So settings uh, that I'm thinking about are in particular the voice, piano or flute, the style, whether it's 8-beat, waltz or swing, but also other parameters as they're often known, such as the style volume. You may find that the voice you go for is reasonably soft, but the volume of the drums, the accompaniment, is just too loud. We'll want to often soften the accompaniment in order not to drown out the main voice, and you want to save these settings uh, for the future use for that particular song. So this video is going to show you how to do that. This particular registration is all to uh, enable me to play Skyfall, the theme tune for 007. So I'm going to S set up five things Firstly, the voice, which I'm going to set to uh, 06 midi grand, and it's there. I'm going to set up the style to 02, 8 beat modern. Thirdly, I'm going to set the ACMP so that it's on. Fourthly, the tempo, I'm going to set to um, 80. The um, last thing I'm going to set is the function. 16 for style volume. I'm going to take it down to 82. So now I'm all set to actually save this setting. So I need to uh, find the regist memory, which of course is for registration memory, the button uh, just down right from the screen. Press and hold it down and you will get a screen that says mem no question mark. And uh, you then proceed to save uh, to the location. Is it one, two, three, four, five, or six within the memory? And I'm going to go for three. And it will come up with uh, R03, that's registration three, overwrite question mark. And yes, I do. So I will uh, tap the button yes. It will uh, confirm that the memorizing is completed when it says mem. OK, and it, um, well, on this occasion, it, it has returned to the name of the style, which is 0028 beat modern. Now, I have just actually switched off the E373, switched it back on again, and I'm going to see if um, this uh, setting that I've hopefully saved is still there. So I press Regist Memory, press and hold down. I'm going to press number three and let's see. And indeed it is uh, there. So even though you switch off the keyboard, the keyboard will save that setting for you, which is good news because some keyboards do not maintain setting work that you've actually done for every parameter.